This is a representation of an ordinary atom made up of protons with positive electrical charges, electrons with negative charges, and neutrons with no charges, neutral particles. Antimatter is a substance composed of atomic particles that have the same masses as the electrons, protons, and neutrons found in ordinary matter. However, each of the particles is of the opposite charge as its normal material counterpart. The component particles of antimatter are called positrons, antiprotons, and antineutrons. Although antineutrons are neutral, they have a magnetic moment opposite in sign to that of the neutron. These three antiparticles make up antiatoms, which in turn make up antimatter. The idea of antimatter is not an easy one to grasp for most people. The first mention of antimatter in scientific literature came in 1930 in the work of the physicist Paul Adrian Maurice Dirac. His work on the energy states of the electron led him to predict the existence of the positron, a particle identical in every respect to the electron, except for the fact that it has a positive charge instead of a negative one. Such a particle was subsequently produced in laboratory experiments. Antimatter, if it is not confined in special traps to isolate it, has an extremely short life, on the order of billionths of a second, before it comes into contact with ordinary matter and is annihilated. Matter and antimatter eliminate each other on contact, with a complete release of the energy held in both. Many attempts in science have been made to study the relevance of antimatter in cosmological problems, because a theoretical understanding of antimatter is relevant to understanding how the universe was created and is constituted. So far, the most common understanding of antimatter comes not from science, but from science fiction, which has popularized the idea of using antimatter to propel spaceships. This is a representation of an ordinary atom made up of protons with positive electrical charges, electrons with negative charges, and neutrons with no charges, neutral particles. Antimatter is a substance composed of atomic particles that have the same masses as the electrons, protons, and neutrons found in ordinary matter. However, each of the particles is of the opposite charge as its normal material counterpart. The component particles of antimatter are.